It is nearly 8.22. The residents of Emmerdale will find their lives on the line when a helicopter crashes into the village this week. And the drama kicks off when Chrissy Sugden sets fire to husband Robert's car after discovering he's been having an affair. Let's have a look at Tuesday night's episode. You're just upset that you got caught! I am ruined! I am heartbroken! Everything I thought that was good was a lie! We both know you're never going to like that. <laughs> now I have made my point! Oh, and Louise Marwood, <laughs> who plays Chrissy, wow. joins us now. That mm. sets off quite a series of events, doesn't yes, it? I it mean, that's does. dramatic enough in itself. That is only the beginning. Yeah. Makes me feel a bit nervous about what's going to happen as a result. Yeah. I've I mean, seen the trailer. Mm -hmm. I think we've all seen the trailer. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a bleak week for Emmerdale, isn't it? I think it's going to be dramatic. Yeah. I, I kind of we talk about so you guys come in and we talk about stunts. But you actually set that car on fire. Yes. That, that wasn't that wasn't CGI. No, you no, did no. that. And there was only one car, so there was pressure to get it right as well. But usually you'd have a few. You had one because that was there's only one car to ruin. Very rare car. <laughs> so a lot of people are very furious about the car well, more than anything a else. Car. Actually, what car yes. is it? Um, good question. I don't know. It what like I do it. know <laughs> is that it was yellow and it was sprayed black and it wasn't the actual car. Um, oh, okay. Yeah. But it was still a. But you still had to set it on fire. Ryan's going to kill me that I don't know. It's his pride and joy. That <laughs> you really should yeah. know. I, I just see anger. She just sees red. She doesn't see anything else. She's a woman scorned, and that's a dangerous thing. We know that um, people, you know, terrible things happen. I know it feels, it feels very sensitive. Mm. I, mean, I think you have to remember that she is a good person, and she behaves in a way that isn't. You know her normal behaviour, and the results, you know, are spectacular and and catastrophic. Fallout and catastrophic, uh, and so devastating. Priority. And this helicopter, there's a helicopter yes. crash. Yes. Which we know is going to cause some damage as well. Uh, how how did you go about doing that? I'm assuming there wasn't a helicopter that crashed. Like there was a I wasn't really down. involved in that side. There was a lot of CGI. We did a lot of sort of looking at the sky. Booms being moved across, pretending it was helicopters sort of hurtling towards the village, which <laughs> tested my acting skills a little bit. Um, and sort of second AD is behind us going bang in really camp voices, and we had to react like it was an explosion, <laughs> so that was fun. Um, but yeah, and a lot of it was CGI, but I didn't have anything to do with the village stuff because we kind of set it sure. all up. Mm. And it's um, a direct result of what Chrissy's done there with the yes, car. Yes, which is going to be really hard for her to deal with, obviously. And the producer has said that, you know, f familiar faces will now be no longer after. Mm. This series of events. Are, we, yes. are, are Emmerdale fans going to lose people who they know and love? They might do. I don't know if I'm allowed to say anything. <laughs> uh, yeah, they might do. I think um, this is a big, big story for Emmerdale. And like I said, the results are going to be catastrophic, but I can't really tell you. These faces we're looking at now aren't necessarily the ones, but they are the ones that maybe could be going. And there's, oh, uh, wow. there's yeah. some, you know, obviously some no, much loved there are. characters there. Yeah. Did, they, did, the, did the actors know? Um, I think so. I think there was a lot of joking in the lead up to the storyline, a lot of sort of helicopter noises and this kind of action <laughs> going on on set. But yeah, yeah. No, you know, people want to leave and move on and do other things. So. Yeah. And it's a dramatic way to go as well. The best way from a soap is with a huge, big, huge story like exit storyline. Yeah, and then we're left to deal with the aftermath yeah. and pick up the pieces. Oh, yeah. we. So that suggests you're one of the survivors. <gasps> Maybe. 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 <laughs> Maybe not. But definitely not the car. Definitely not the car. No, that's the car gone. is gone. The car is gone. I just, yeah, Ryan's going to be furious. I don't actually <laughs> know what kind of car that is. He'll be is. tweeting you right now. Can you imagine you the this. ignorance of that? Yeah. <laughs> well, it is no more, so you don't need to worry about it. No, it's Absolutely gone. lovely to yeah. see. Thanks Louise, for coming. Thank Good, Good luck this week. We'll look forward to how it all unfolds.